Hello everyone and welcome to the post maintenance update for December 20, 2012. Uh, we recently got the Shamala update which was G17 Season 3. That means we got the Shamala storyline quest along with Shamala in core. You'll get a blue wing when you log in, or at least you should. Uh, Transforming collection journal thing has been added along with the hunting collection. Uh, Lord missions are also added. You must have at least one master talent to get in these special missions. There are three missions available in Terra. I heard elsewhere there are two in Terra and one in Taltian. However, the main page says Terra, so we're going with that. Uh, each party member taking part in the mission must have a pass, and they're harder than any missions previously available in game, supposedly. That might be up to debate. Anyway, demon weapons have been added, which are new weapons that you have to have a master in the specific talent to wield the weapon. You can craft them using uh, the various life skills and new enchants that can only be found in Lord missions. I believe those in those new enchants though are exclusive to Lord weapons. Uh, the required XP per level has been adjusted. I believe it's now lower, so you can level up faster and get more AP. Uh, that brings us to the events. Uh, there are new uh, new winter character cards. that are Nutcracker and Swan Lake. The, the outfits both have an idle information idle animations which is marching for the males and ballet for the females. The cheetah pet has been added which is the fastest land mount ever made according to the website. Each comes with a gift box including a title and a chance to either a cheetah bell paw club or a cheetah headband. The shamala gachapon has been added which contains either a gesture or an NPC transformation medal. A uh, shadow crystal is also included into each box if you get a medal you already have, you can turn it into a coupon, and three coupons will give you a new random NPC medal. Uh, monster urns have been added back into the cash shop, and these are a limited time, starting with the character cards and going down to uh, the monster urns. Each urn comes with a monster transformation coin and one additional item. If you already have a monster transformation, you can trade with someone else. Includes a chance at prizes such as the new Shamala outfit, the Puri and Colossic. Colossus outfits, Hue and Puppet Theater outfits, as well as various pre-enchanted armor and weapons including Oblivion and Spike enchants, and items with pre-rank set 1 and 2 reforges. Uh, there are two events going on right now, the Shamala event, which means if you complete the Shamala storyline during the event to receive a special prefix title, Shamala, which gives you 20 HP, 10 stamina, and complete all the event transformation quests to earn the ability to transform into Fergus. Fun time there. Snowball fight requires uh, two teams of eight people. Your goal is to overtake the other team's snowman. Not exactly how that works, but hopefully I'll get an event video out soon here. Uh, you can obtain the Caravan Joe's box pieces. Players who win the snowball fight will get one box piece per fight. Players who compete the daily quest obtain one box piece and a 5 AP potion. Combine five pieces of the boxes to get a box. Collect five gift box pieces to earn one prize box. So either there's two different boxes there, or at any rate, collect five boxes and or box pieces, and you'll get a gift box. And there were a couple bug fixes, and also some known issues, such as uh, these are the ones that people might want to hear about. Uh, Bell Fox outfits don't currently pose. Some items are not un are not translated. Uh, introductory dialogue for quest name and description with Yvonne when speaking to her about the transformation quest is currently untranslated. Maiden Butler head styles, hairstyles are removed from the beauty shop. Um, the Phoenix, and these are the fixes, the Phoenix is now translated, bone dragons appear correctly when hotkeyed, continent warp no longer lights up on pets that can't be continent warped on. When knocked unconscious, players are able to now access the item shop and buy nail soul stone so you can revive. Commerce partners now have the option to put them down while they're on the player's back. Commerce partners issues when wielding items are fixed, however they will no longer use the posing animations with animated clothes. Uh, when a partner is summoning milking XP will increase correctly. Alright, so those are the main patch notes. Um, the reward lists for uh, the snowball fight include a lot of things we've seen before. But also the ice crown and the ice crown for both male and female are kind of the new things that are uh, the big things that you want to know about. Uh, the the transformation Shamala Gachapon, you can get various uh, NPCs and gestures from. I, I believe I mentioned that. Same with the monster ores and there's the character cards, which are nine 
thousand five hundred next in the character shop and the cheetah is not listed how much it is on the shop however it says it gets with the title which gives you eight max damage two critical one protection and two speed uh, also, uh, there are some rumors going around that what we got and what we didn't got. Supposedly, there may be daily AP quests. However, I have not been able to either confirm or deny their existence. And supposedly, that allows you to do one in Terra, one in Taltian for a grand total of three AP per day. However, like I said, those are rumors, and I'm pretty sure they may not be in because there's no official release. However, they could possibly have snuck in there beneath most people's noses. Uh, that is the update. A lot of things are untranslated. You get lots of quests when you first log in. You get a wing to Dunburton and a wing to Core. And several quests. I'll try to look at those now real quick. Um, there's Understanding Transformation, which you have to collect collect for the Transformation Diary, and you'll get 5 AP and 1,000 XP. Uh, puppets quest is old. And if you complete in 5 Snowball Fights, you will get a 5 AP potion and a Caravan Joe gift piece. Uh, like I mentioned, this is the untranslated quest they're talking about, but it has something to do with tran the transformation skills, because that's what's said on the main site. Uh, there's another transformation quest, which all you have to do is ask Shamala and Core about transformation, and get 5,000 AP from that. And then the Snowball Fight regular quest, just talk to Caravan Joe, and that's a 5,000 XP right there. There's the path of trans uh, Shamala, which you have to transform into White Seal, and you get 40,000 XP from that. And that's an old quest. Alright, so that's basically all that is here at first glance. I'll try to annotate and add in the description the stuff that I missed and or got wrong. Um, I will uh, try to uh, get some a... Uh, for the Shamala storyline, I'll try to get a quest line video of that up here within the next couple days. Uh, well, it'll finish in the next couple days. Hopefully I'll, hopefully I'll get a video up here pretty soon. At any rate, and then I'll also try to get a a guide or at least a playthrough of the Snowball mini game if I can get one together, so that you can see how that works. Uh, oh, another thing is that we actually got um, inventory search. So if I want to search HP potions, H. I guess I don't have any HP potions, but I do have MP potions. It actually doesn't search for anything, so I have to do an MP. Okay, so I guess you have to do capital, just like it is. It must be case sensitive. So we gotta search things, and you can search for pets also, I believe. Uh, sorry, this is, I had forgotten about this, and for some reason T doesn't do pets, but I can't summon pets in the homestead, so I'm gonna exit out that real quick. We have an inventory search button, which should be useful for those with extra inventory service and that get lots of inventory things in their inventory. And supposedly we have two new pet features. One is a search pet inventory, and the other thing is to set notes. So uh, my deer right here, is my potion oh so it's over there on the side of the screen can I drag that somewhere over here I can't uh, here let's move this there we go so uh, my deer is my gem pet so I'm gonna save that and then quit and then I'm not entirely sure what that does new sorts okay right here it says right here, so it says gem. It says my dear's my gem pet, as you will see here. And we get, uh, and I have gems on there, which did not like that that made gems. But that's a way of sorting through your pets uh, to make sure that you have everything right. We also supposedly got the option to search through pet inventories. However, I'm not quite sure. That's the wrong button. Not quite sure how to do that yet. Uh, see, I know I have uh, garnets on my deer that didn't do anything that I know of so how that uh, feature comes in I'm not sure I'll probably annotate it right here saying oh here's how to do it and probably something really stupid that I missed but I'm recording live so it gets a little tricky to do that so anyway I will try to get those videos out and try to annotate anything I missed so you can come this one stop thing to know all that happens and thank you for watching and have fun have fun with Shamala